If you're only watching these videos on YouTube, you're really missing a lot of information. I post to Facebook a lot more than YouTube. Uh, a while back I posted a video, I had some severe knocking on the engine. I thought maybe I was timed too high. I also uh, made a video for Facebook showing all my pop pressure settings and spray patterns and suspected the injectors. I'm sorry, I was hopeful it was the injectors, but not really convinced. So I ordered some Basios, and those are going to take about 30 days to get into me. So I probably got another two, three weeks before I, I see those. So in the meantime, I was fortunate enough, I imported a couple engines from the UK. And I went ahead and popped this one open, took all the injectors out, cleaned them up. And I put them in my 606. And when I did that, uh, the knocking did not go away. So these injectors could be faulty as well. They could have stuff in them, but it sounds exactly the same. I strongly suspect that I spun a rod bearing or there's something else on the bottom end. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and build this engine up. I'm going to put uh, F-Tune rods in it. They're I-beam, not uh, H, like my, like my uh, Auto Verdes. I'm going to put a 7.5 millimeter 603 pump in it, HX35. And uh, probably I'll put my KKD header back on it and a um, quick spool from BD Diesel. My goal is to uh, build this up, swap it with what's in my car, prove this engine is sound, and fix the engine that's in my car. When I'm done, I'm going to swap them, and then I will sell this crate engine. And that does a couple things. One, it affords me the luxury to fix the engine in my car at my own pace. At the same time, it will prove the uh, the build that I'm going to sell. I want to make sure that it is very strong and runs as expected. So I think uh, the buyer of that engine as well as uh, myself will benefit greatly from that process. So hey, thanks for watching. Just wanted to give you an update.